To be an effective defense attorney is a duty of courage. Very few people in society would love a spokesperson of a bad guy. Therefore, as a defense attorney, your commitment is to the law. What must you do in order for the society to believe that you have a duty to do justice? To that guy who has been despised, to that guy who has been called all sorts of names, no wonder. So many politicians have been given lanes. They have roads named after them. They have bridges named after them. But never in my entire research in Uganda have I come across a road that has been named after a defense attorney. Defense lawyers have a lot of commitment to their clients. Sleepless nights. They do so much investigation in order to rescue this person who has been despised. And in most cases, until the prosecution has proved its case beyond reasonable doubt, you can never, you as a person in society, you as a bystander, come to the conclusion that the guy is guilty. To me, let there be equality of arms. Let the prosecutors not be given a leeway to say that whatever they say is the golden truth. Let the defense attorney not be despised. Because in most cases, when a defense attorney decides to submit on behalf of a client, he will be treated with caution, with suspicion, because they honestly believe that what you say is not true. Lastly, if you have a commitment to justice, a commitment to the rule of law, even if you practice in a dodgy system, even if you practice in a system that does not believe in the rule of law, as long as law lives elsewhere, you can succeed as a defense attorney. Thank you.